<laughs> someone said to me over the weekend, you shipped an AGI and I somehow like am just going about my daily life and I'm not that impressed. Digital superintelligence, that might be the most significant technology that humanity ever creates. Um, and, and it has the potential to be more dangerous than um, nuclear weapons. What if someone told you that the world's most powerful AI is no longer in the world of science fiction? OpenAI and ChatGPT have already covered enough digital space, so it's time we also peek at their future plans. The young company sent shockwaves around the world when it released ChatGPT, but that was just the start. The ultimate goal is change everything. Yep, everything. Non-IT folks have a tendency to think of everything related to IT as one collective entity. But as insiders, we know that it couldn't be any further from the truth. Front-end folks need help understanding what happens in the back-end, and the back-end team thinks of the front-end as a fairly easy job. The worst-case scenario might be the invisible wall of unknown between AI and non-AI folks. Last November, when OpenAI let loose its monster hit, ChatGPT, it triggered a tech explosion not seen since the internet burst into our lives. Suddenly, the Turing test was history. Search engines were endangered species, and no college essay could ever be trusted. No job was safe. No scientific problem was immutable. Altman didn't do the research, train the neural net, or code the interface of ChatGPT and its more intelligent sibling, GPT-4. But as CEO and a dreamer-doer type who's like a younger version of his co-founder, Elon Musk, without the baggage, one news article after another has used his photo as the visual symbol of humanity's new challenge. Like my prediction for AGI would roughly match that, which I, I think Ray as well at one point said 2029. That would rough, that's roughly my guess too, give or take a year. So if, you know, if it takes like an additional six months or 12 months for AGI, that's really not a big deal. If it's, you know, like spending a year to make sure AGI is safe, probably worthwhile. You know, if that's what it takes, but I, I wouldn't expect it to. At least those that haven't led with an eye-popping image generated by OpenAI's visual AI product, Dali. He is the oracle of the moment, the figure that people want to consult first on how AI might usher in a golden age or consign humans to irrelevance or worse. What is AGI? AGI stands for Artificial General Intelligence, an AI system that can do anything a human can. They are not just limited to one specific task. Many different projects and companies are working to make AGI possible. These projects include OpenEye's DeepQA, IBM's Watson, and Google's DeepMind. So, what does this mean for the future? If you think about it, there is no limit to what AGI could achieve. This would allow more complex problems to be solved faster than ever before. For example, if you wanted to search vast amounts of data or find specific patterns in data, AGI would be able, ah, uh, to do it faster than someone searching manually with the same amount of data. As technology progresses, artificial intelligence will continue to grow. ChatGPT creator OpenAI quietly revised all of the core values listed on its website in recent weeks, putting a greater emphasis on the development of AGI, Artificial General, Intelligence. CEO Sam Altman has described AGI as the equivalent of a median human that you could hire as a co-worker. OpenAI's careers page previously listed six core values for its employees, according to a September 25th screenshot from the Internet Archive. They were audacious, thoughtful, unpretentious, impact-driven, collaborative, and growth-oriented. The same page now lists five values, with AGI focus being the first. Anything that doesn't help with that is out of scope, the website reads. The others are intense and scrappy. Scale, make something people love, and team spirit. The way machines operate has changed as a result of artificial intelligence. If you use AI tools to train it, your computer can now perform a wide range of personal and professional tasks. Creating images, converting text to voice, managing utilities and other tasks are a few examples. However, these could be smarter. 
Such automation comes after many months of training. AGI is required to replace humans in dangerous environments. Furthermore, AGI systems can provide unexpected productivity gains for corporate operations. Applications of artificial intelligence, AI, will also aid humankind in the solution of challenging problems in the social sciences, economics, finance, healthcare, and medicine. Applications of artificial intelligence, AI, can demonstrate a deeper comprehension of cause and effect to assist humans in risk assessment tasks. When it comes to original ideas, AGIs can assist designers, architects, artists, and content creators. Color, sound, depth, images, and dimensions are among the sensory perceptions that AGIs can use. With effectiveness, automation will be made simpler by an AGI's ability to process natural language. Simply speak some keywords, and the AGI tool will create the automated flow you want. Since AGI apps also display emotional and social intelligence, they can provide outstanding customer service without fail. Strong AI uses the theory of mind AI framework not to replicate or simulate. It's about training machines to understand humans to differentiate needs, emotions, beliefs, and thought processes. But all these aren't easy. AI researchers and scientists need to find a way to make machines conscious, programming a full set of cognitive abilities. To give you an example, Fujitsu built K, one of the fastest supercomputers, also a notable attempt at achieving strong AI. System took 40 minutes to simulate a single second of neural activity. So, this makes us understand that stone AI is difficult to achieve in the foreseeable future. Can AI ever achieve general intelligence? As we have seen in our earlier discussion, the AI system can't achieve AGI now, as we need to have complete knowledge of our brains, it is hard to model and replicate it. However, theoretically, replicating the human brain using algorithms is possible, as suggested by the Church-Turing thesis, that given infinite time and memory, any problem can be solved algorithmically. Emerging artificial general intelligence companies are putting various efforts into generalizing the capabilities of AI algorithms and upgrading AI systems. Scientists are involved in various efforts to generalize AI algorithms' capabilities and believe that the path forward is hybrid artificial. Intelligence, a combination of neural networks and rule-based systems. But some other scientists or rescuers believe that pure neural network-based models will eventually develop reasoning capabilities. Will any of these approaches bring us closer to AGI or will they open more roadblocks? Time will tell. But what's for sure is that there will be a lot of exciting experiments along the way. AI is a reactive smart application, also known as narrow AI. When signals from event triggers are received, it will respond with a predetermined list of actions. Event triggers won't be necessary for AGIs. These apps will act proactively to avoid issues, solve puzzles, and more, just like humans do. An entire manufacturing facility, thousands of residences in a neighborhood, or all of your company's corporate offices could be operated by a single AGI. Because it is capable of cognitive learning, reasoning, and proactive action taking, it is open to any challenge. The majority of subpar AI programs run on machines with little memory. Training databases and a collection of artificial neural networks are essential to AIs. AIs become stuck when the database or algorithms are outdated. Thanks to the internet, cloud databases, and local databases, AGIs will have practically infinite memory. When will we get AGI? This is the burning question. Are we capable of achieving AGI? Optimistic experts believe AGI and ASI are possible, but it's hard to decide how far away we are from realizing these levels of AI. You can take a look at some of the myths and facts about AGI and ASI. Depending on who you listen to, we already have AGIs. We will never get AGIs or AGIs are coming in the next few weeks, months, uh, years, decades. No one really agrees on a definition, though many very smart people are trying to build one. The term AGI is so prevalent now because tools like ChatGPT are forcing us to reconsider our definitions of AI. 
The latest LLMs easily passed the Turing test, the earliest, attempt to define what it meant for computers to think. But for all their power, ChatGPT and company are still miles away from a sci-fi AI like Star Trek's data. So maybe an AGI is an AI capable of being a character in a space opera. What are your thoughts on this? Let us know in the comment section below. If you liked today's video, then leave a thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe to the channel. See you again soon in another video.